What is going on everyone? Welcome back. In today's video, we're going over all the map changes from this most recent update, starting with this. The blimp that was originally over at Rave Cave can now be found at Tilted Towers, as you can see on this map. And you can already tell that there's a lot of map changes, right? So let's go ahead and get into it. There's been a new heli carrier spotted by the seven outposts in between the sanctuary and lazy lagoon and in addition to that there's been a third heli carrier spotted as well it's going to be over by the mansion over by log jams so if you're on that side of the map definitely keep an eye out for those you can definitely find some really good loot if you're able to get the keys to get in there you know into the little small vaults that they normally hold. But speaking of the north, south of the map, how do I want to transition that? But speaking of vaults, no, 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 I'm skipping that. But speaking of things flying, down at Cloudy Condos, you can find the lighthouse. The lighthouse has now traveled from the north side of the map all the way down to cloudy condos it is it looks like it's attached in this photo but it's not it's not attached it's just kind of floating above and nearby where the cloudy condos is so if you like landing lighthouse i guess now you get the extra loot from condo canyon as well or cloudy condos whatever it's called now <laughs> i can't keep up they change it way too quick there's also a new high security vault that can be found over by Greasy. So if you land over there on the west side of the map, like I do, I like landing reality tree. So I'll definitely be rotating over to Greasy to try to grab this vault if it has not been taken already. I do know a lot of people like landing Greasy, so it could be taken already or could be in the process of being looted. So might be some easy picks for me. Uh, who knows? <laughs> Moving on, it looks like the people of the island, the loopers, not necessarily the loopers, but the people who live on the island that really have no idea what's going on. We haven't really seen them. Uh, we just know the loopers, but they're getting ready for Halloween. And you can see all the houses all around the area have been decorated all the way from Risky Reels all the way to like condo canyon there's a lot of them even the the no name pois even they have decorations out front of their houses all to get ready for halloween which is right around the corner speaking of halloween and this update how have y'all been enjoying fort nightmares do you like it do you think it's better than last year's let me know down in the comments additionally it looks like the chrome is spreading all around the map as well and from the looks of it it looks like the chrome is making its way towards uh reality tree and kind of skipping all the other pois and just going like around them to get to the reality tree you best bet this is going to be a big point of interest when it comes to the live event this chrome taking over the reality tree if it takes over the reality tree is definitely going to play a part in the live event that more than likely we're going to have at the end of this season i mean we we didn't have one last season or the season before last i don't think so we're overdue for a live event and with it possibly being the last season of the chapter we should have a live event but more on that in another video, so make sure you subscribe and hit that bell for notifications so that way you don't miss that upload. But speaking of the reality tree, if you drop over there and land, you now can see the fox partying over at the reality tree, dropping some sick beats, maybe for, you know, the people who decide to uh, sell their soul and become a werewolf, as we talked about in my last video, if you haven't seen that. Check it out after this one. But yeah, he's just having a good old time over there at Reality Tree. Just, you know, mixing up the beats for all the, the party goers. You know, Halloween. Some people party, you know. You gotta do what you gotta do. Where, where best to do it other than the Reality Tree. 
And this next thing I want to talk about is something that I can't believe didn't happen sooner. And it looks like police cars were actually added back in today's update. And I think it'd be really cool if, if Epic made these drivable with the working lights and sirens. So that way you could go around the map and just, you know, wee -woo, wee -woo, wee -woo. whenever you see somebody, I think that'd be funny. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think for sure on that. But police cars are back. We haven't really seen police cars ever since, uh, what, chapter two, season three? When we got the update for the actual drivable cars, when they went from, you know, harvestable mats to mobility. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I'm right on that. I might be a few seasons off there, but I think it was chapter two, season three. Speaking of old maps, nice little uh, transition there, I guess. Um, Shifty Shafts and the old mine that's underneath Shifty Shafts has been dug out and it reveals this old tunnel and a new darkness is dwelling within. Definitely something uh, weird going on down here, but apparently this is where you summon the new mythic boss that's over, you know, in the in the basement of the Grim Grable Gables. Uh, if you chop through the floor, it'll bring you down to this mine and you do this little ritual and it'll actually summon him and then you fight him. And he's pretty tough actually. Not gonna lie, but yeah, definitely pretty interesting. I wonder if he's gonna play a part in like the storyline. I hope so. Cause with this much detail and like build for this like random Halloween boss, I'd really be disappointed if he didn't have, uh, you know, a way of playing a part in the storyline. And I've got one last thing for you guys today, and that is Shroom Charlotte has been transformed into Willow's Haunt. And of course, it's also been decorated with decorations for Halloween. But Willow is a boss that spawns here now and will sprint after you, attacking you with an ax if you destroy the decorations. It's actually pretty scary, if you ask me. But I really like this, like, epic giving the NPCs just weird items, kind of like, you know, any kind of horror movie type deal, and then coming at you with it instead of like a normal gun like they would have. I don't know. I think it's funny and cool. Let me know what you guys think. But that's gonna do it for me today, guys. Hit that like button, subscribe if you're new, and turn on the bell for notifications so that way you don't miss a upload. We have a lot of stuff to talk about, especially the possibility of this being the last season of chapter three. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.